beautiful gems. How are you all doing today? Hope you're having an amazing day wherever you are. So today, I'm teaming up with Mr. Danny. ARD group. It's our life ARD. And okay, that's the canto there. Pretty good. My family and I are heading down to Cane Grove in Patwa Scheme to distribute food hampers to those families in need. So join us on our adventure. What is that for the back here, Danny? That's a really smell though. So we're distributing to the houses directly. Yes, down, down the dam there. Just one person to that house. So I took that just two and follow them girl and do the another two there. Good morning. Sometimes you need to go. Are you going out anymore? Take a step back. See the truth. So, here is one more of our um, Guyanese YouTuber. What, what's your name? One is from Danny. Uh, that's a channel name as well. Yeah. He, okay. had, he had a channel before, had about 1,000 subscribers, and then eventually he, he lost the password to the account, so he lost that account. So he has a new account now. It's M-U-N-E-S-H. R-A-M-D-H-A-N-I. R-A-M-D-H-A-N-I. Muneh Shramdan. He's a guy I need to do it though. So give him a big shout out. All right? So we made a stop here for a lunch break. You know, it's a couple hours project we are right now. What do we have for lunch? Look at the school buses. So we're getting um, ice, cream. ice cream. Ice cream for ice cream. I, I like the drink too. Yeah. Okay, let's yeah. swim? Yeah. <laughs> oh my, we only wait, we only. I'm only, I don't know. Nice black water here, guys. <laughs> don't do that. I don't know how to swim. I gotta learn. Moonlight, 
birds. No, those are wild duck. I want to jump in. <laughs> Come on, paddle, paddle. Breathe too much. Park your boat now. <laughs> and that is how you row a boat. Row, row, row your boat gently down the stream. Is it fun? like to live on, on a farm simple, humble. Oh. those bananas you guys can pick, pick them up later yeah, yeah. oh, planting oh, okay yeah there's a heavy breeze uh-huh yeah. nice juicy and sweet <laughs> Can I try any on any day? Okay, we're good. Can I try any on any day? Can I try any on any day? Can I try any on any day? That's a honeybee nest. Okay, time to go. Alright, so Danny is about to go throw, catch some fish. Let's see his luck. Wow, buddy, what's some more fish you get in? Are you going to throw again? That's it. No fish. Come early morning. Stop looking at me. I bet four to hack it up. That's a lot.
so we're waiting on the boat to go into the canal. That is that a boat? Okay. This one is gonna be for Mr. A or Mr. Danny. Buttercup. Oh, we're going to the jungle. <laughs> we're in the jungle. This is not the jungle. <laughs> yeah, mango all over. What's up there? It has a lot of mangoes on the tree. You gotta get a lot of them fingers. <laughs> Normally most of them animals and yeah. birds and some things. The monkey over here? One, it had a baboon the other day when I see Oh god. <laughs> a little one. Oh, baby one. I would have run. <laughs> oh god, this looks so nice. So, you see how over there, all the, all the way down is Bora, yeah, or long bean here, mostly bora. Oh, yeah, okay, yeah, yeah. yeah. there's a bora creek, <laughs> and over that side is rice. 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 Okay, yeah, so as far as they can see, is bora 12 acres of land of bora. Bora farm, right? Yeah. How did you guys see? Oh, he's so cute. Look at this fine time tree, guys. Isn't it beautiful? Lime tree. Pigeon peas, yes. Nice cook up rice. Hungry. My beans and for oh, there we go. We got one. Ha! It's a nice place. Peaceful. What? It's more by the restaurant. Well, it's lime. It's lime. So yeah. You guys put on your lime jacket. No, ma'am. What happened here? <laughs> Yeah. Yes. Yeah, buddy. You wanna go? Back? You wanna go back? Yeah, what? You wanna go back? So you don't walk around there? Yeah, what? Okay. Okay. Yeah, okay. Yeah, 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 Okay, so we had fun and now we're leaving. Say bye to the farm. Come on, kids, let's go. No, they want to stay. We want to stay. Thank you so much, for everything. All right. See you later. Okay, bye. Thanks again. 
And we're off again. <laughs> yeah, like my rose, my hibiscus. I guarantee next time I come back, I'm gonna learn to swim. Oh my god, I'm a burnt potato. <laughs> Always as usual, good. Thankful for life itself. Oh, and Eid Mubarak to all those Muslim brothers and sisters around the world. Yes. You know, today it's, it's Sunday, Eid. 24th of May, and it's Eid. I just want to say, May the peace, peace and blessing of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala be upon you and your family. Eid Mubarak. Eid Mubarak. So my beautiful gems, we had an amazing day today and we're now leaving Mahaika to head back home. Um, thank you all for watching my video and from Little Baibu, see you in my next video. So we're back home. And this is all the lovely fruits we got from the people down in Mahaika. I just want to say a big thank you to you guys. Hey my beautiful gems, how are you all doing today? So yesterday was an amazing day. My family and I, we went down to Long Dam and Patwaskeem Cane Grove to do one act of kindness. I would like to thank my husband, Danny from It's Our Life ARD and his team and all those who donated to this great cause. You know, it touched my heart to see the smiles on those people's faces when they received their hampers. So with that being said, yesterday was Eid. I would like to say Eid Mubarak to all my Muslim brothers and sisters. So today I'll be making Sirni and I would like to give a big shout out to Anthony Srinandan. Thank you for being a part of Sparkle and Things family. I love you and stay blessed. Now I grew up in a home where we had all religion and races. So I know a thing or two of each. Also I'd like to thank my mom for teaching me how to make Sirni. So join me and let's get cooking. So these are my ingredients that I'll be using today. Here I have cinnamon stick, clove, nutmeg, raisins, nut. Now you can use any roasted nut you prefer. I have raw nuts, so I'll have to roast these. Condensed milk, evaporated milk, essence, butter or margarine, Cherries, red or green, anyone you prefer. Drink or soda, anyone you prefer, red or orange. Custard powder, this is optional. Cream of wheat, I'm using cream of wheat today. Um, there are different flavors, so you can use any one you prefer. Or if you don't have cream of wheat, you can use flour. Over here, I have sugar for extra sweetness but I'm not going to use sugar because the condensed milk, the drink and the cherry they're already sweet. You can also use elaichi or cardamom and eggs but I don't have that today so I'm using what I have. As always I'll leave the ingredients and instructions in the description box below. So here I have my my nut. I'm just gonna give it a little wash. Here, I'll dry them a little. And now I'll roast these in my oven until it's nice and golden brown. Let's check on our nut. 
it's about 10 minutes now and kind of a peachish color so I'm gonna leave this to go for about five minutes more my nut is ready they're all nice and golden brown so I'm gonna leave this to cool for a bit and then I'm gonna crush it up all right so here I have my roasted nut and I'm going to put it in a tissue or a cloth whatever you prefer and I'm going to just this up like that not too fine it should be a bit chunky now if you're allergic to nuts you can totally omit this this is optional here I have my raisins I'm gonna rinse them and then leave them to soak until I'm ready to use it so here I have my red and green cherries and as you can see they are still whole so I'm gonna just give it a rough chop into small pieces so the cream of wheat comes in these little packets so I'll use all 10 of the little packets I guess that'll give you about a pound Now I have a scale here and I'm going to use a plastic wrap to cover my scale and measure about a pound of cream of wheat. So let's see. I've added two more packets to make one pound. So in total, 12 packets I used. So here I'm going to grate my nutmeg. We're going to use this side and be careful not to break your hands when you're doing this. And remember to clean up as you go. It makes life easier. Now I have a mug here and I'm going to combine carnation milk, my condensed milk, now with the condensed milk, you can use half a tin if you want it less sweet because using this entire tin of condensed milk, it can still be extra sweet. So use to your preference. My grated nutmeg, one tablespoon essence, two tablespoon custard powder, And I'll be using the same evaporated milk tin to measure one tin and a half of the drink. So it's frothing a lot here, so I'll have to wait until the froth goes down. So I'll give this a good stir and set it aside until I'm ready. All right, so I'm gonna put my stove to medium heat. And then I'm going to add in one pound of butter or margarine. Now my butter is all melted. Now I'll add in the cream of wheat. I'm going to add in my spice, my cloves, now you're going to patch it to get a nice golden brown color for about 10 to 15 minutes on, on low to medium heat. So now I'm going to add the milk mixture. But remember to add it slowly. So here I have Selena to help me to pour in the mixture. And remember to mix your milk mixture before you start it to pour it. Okay, 
careful, careful. Remember to keep turning, guys. So I have my fire on low heat. Thank you so much. You're welcome. So this is gonna boil. Okay, so this is gonna dry down and we're gonna get a soft, crumbly texture. Selena, please bring the, um, the nuts. Train the nuts. And now I'm going to add in my cherries. And raisin. Remember to keep turning. So I'm gonna raise my stove a little bit more. It smells great in here, guys. Right, so it's all nice and dry now. So we'll take this off. And now our sirni is finished. Time to serve. So there you have it. Our sirni is finished. Hope you'll give my recipe a try and enjoy it. Remember, everyone cooks differently. So my beautiful gems, thank you all for watching my video. God bless you. I love you. Be safe. And see you in my next video.